Canadian curriculum, Grade 8, Exponents, Chapter 1. I'm going to start a new uh, unit on exponents, or stopping volume and surface area. If you didn't check out my last videos, please check them out before you start exponents. Uh, okay, so exponents. These right here are exponents. But before we start our worksheet, let's go up and read the top. Okay, exponents. Now, this is an exponent right here, the small 5, right? So, 2 to the power of 5 is equal to 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, which is 32. I'll give you some easy ones to start off with. 2 to the power of 2 is equal to 2 times 2, and that is 4. So, 2 to the power of 2 is 4. So, Let's say 3 to the power of 2 is equals to 3 times 3, and 3 times 3 is 9. So 3 to the power of 2, 3, 2 is 9. Okay, so it's not multiplication. You're not supposed to multiply 2 by 10. 2 times 10 is, no, 2 times 5. 2 times 5 is 10, and that's a completely wrong answer. 32 and 10, and because we're doing exponents. Okay, if you multiply 2 times 2, which is 4, that will give you the right answer for that, but it's but it's not right. It's it won't you could you could do that, but it's not right because it won't work for the rest of them. 3 times 2 is 6, not 9. Right? So, that's exponents. It's a little bit harder, but I find it fun. Okay. So, let's start question number 1. Like, here's a funny little example right here. Uh, these are germs in this plate that someone just ate from. We double ourselves every minute. There will be 32 of us after 5 minutes. Okay, let's start. Rate each product of powers. Okay, so 3 times 3 times 3 times 4 times 4. How many 4s do we see? We see two fours. so we're going to write to the power of 2 right here and for 3's since there are 3 3's we're going to write to the power of 3 so we're done the first question now in question number 3 we see 2.5 two 2 5 so 2.5 to the power of 2 times and we see 2 8's 8 to the power of 2 so that's another answer er, and keep on going just like this. 5 times 5, 5 to the power of 2. And 9, there are 3 nines times 9 to the power of 3. Pretty easy. Okay, let's go to question number 2. 6 times 6 times 6, 4 sixes to the power of 4, 8 twos. So 8 to the power of 2. Let's move on to this. 1, 2, 3, 4. There are 4, 1.7. So 1.7 to the power of 4 times. 2 5's, 5 to the power of 2. Pretty easy. Okay, let's let's do question number 6. 4.6, there are 2 4.6's, times 7, there are 3 7's. 1, 2, 3. So exponents, it's really easy. And now, 10 times 7.8 times 7.8 times 10 times 2 times 2. In this question, there are 3 different numbers. Okay, so let's start off with 2. So how many twos do you see? There are two twos. Okay, two times seven point eight. How many seven point eights? Two four four seven point eights times ten. There are three tens. So ten three ten to the power of three. And let's just finish these two questions fast. Six point three tens. Okay, now 3 times 3, no, actually, it's 3 to the power of 2 times 3 to the power of 2, which is also 3 to the power of 4, but I, I just wrote it like this just to show you there are different ways, and 
times 4 to the power of 2 times 4 to the power of 3 times 5 to the 5.5 to the power of 2 since they're two 5.5s. Okay, now that we're done question 1 to 9, I'll let you try to do them yourself. Yeah, so when you're done doing this, we'll move on to um, question number 10. And write the integers as powers. Now let's see what the hint says. Write 16 as a power of 2. So 16 is equal to 2 times 8 is equal to 2 times 2 times 4 is equal to 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 is equal to 2 to the power of 4. Okay, let's try let's try it with question number 10. Okay, so um, 27 times 3. So let's write 27 right here. And then, okay, 27, 3 times, let's put 3 right here and 9. 3 and 9 right here. And then 3 times 3. And then you could break up the 9 into two threes. 3 and another 3. And 3 times 3 is equal to 9 times 9 is equal to 81. 81 is equal to 3 to the power of 4. So there you go. There is a answer for question number 10. Now let's move on to these uh, uh, 11 to 16. Okay, so 125 as a power of 5. Now you have to think of it yourself. Go on to question number 12. So 100, uh, uh, 1,296 as a power of 6. Think of it yourself. Uh, question number 13, 243 as a power of 3, which would... Um, which I'll answer to you after, but first I'll show you the two first two answers, which is 125 as the power of five, it's five, five to the power of three, and because five times five is 25, times five is 125. So and there are three fives involving in this case, so it's to the power of three. Same with question number 12, and same with all of the rest of them. I'll figure out all the rest of them. Okay, then do it yourself. You could check the answers with all my answers um, to see if they're right because I'm sure my answers are right because I did this a lot of times. And yeah, if you want to see any of my other videos, check, uh, click on my channel, watch my other videos. If you have any suggestions of if I, if you want me to do something, I'll do it for you because I have a lot of time. And yeah. Next video is going to, if you haven't checked out my last videos, check them out. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like.